I'm Teresa Haightley from the Soil Conservation Service. I'm the project manager for the remediation of the North Wombo Creek diversion. The SoilCon team have been working closely with the Wombo Coal Environment Team to ensure that Peabody Energy's remediation goals for North Wombo Creek are met. The objective of the project was to ensure long-term stability of North Wombo Creek with the aim to provide for healthy water flow through the catchment, for the provision of habitat for aquatic and terrestrial species, and the provision of a stable substrate for the growth of a biodiverse woodland vegetation profile. So the goal here for the creek diversion is, is really to re-establish uh, environmental flows and get the creek diversion to function as best we can as, as a natural stream. So the work that uh, SoilCon have done here to date is really allowing us to, to progress on that front and work towards that goal. So far we're extremely happy with what's been done and feel that you know we are ultimately going to achieve that goal. SoilCon constructed a series of flume cascades to allow for stable water entry into the diversion from the surrounding landscape. We also constructed creek stabilisation structures within the channel, such as rock riffles and bed controls. We introduced large woody debris deflectors to provide bank stabilisation and geomorphic diversity. By reprofiling the lower benches and incorporating organic matter, we were able to provide for a stable substrate for the sowing of locally sourced seed that matches the surrounding vegetation profile. There's also a rock riffle being constructed, so they will, um, for a pull and riffle sequence, so that will improve uh, the biodiversity of aquatic species, um, as well as improving water quality. On top of that, it's not just water flowing through the creek, it's uh, the overland flows from the surrounding area. So we've also had four rock cascade flumes constructed, two are completed, two are going right now. They're stepped in shape as well in the low flow channel, so that's to convey water um, runoff into the creek in a stable manner, also slowing down water velocity with the steps. So there were numerous challenges here on site. So there was an underground spring um, up on the high bank. So initially uh, there was to be a cutoff trench on all these flumes, but this water was um, seeping and coming out halfway through the flume at the cutout stage. To overcome this, we dug down, uh, realised that the water was seeping below our original cutoff depth. So we increased that, compacted some clay, and in front of that cutoff trench, we also put ag pipe to disperse the water away from coming out in the flume. SoilCon have been fantastic here on site. They've met all our safety requirements, which is paramount in the mining industry. They've really been quite self-sufficient. They've followed the guidelines that we presented, project managed fantastically, and, and really it's allowed a lot of confidence in the work that they've done. Um, that's also obviously been demonstrated in their work, and you can see the time and, and care that's gone into the construction here. You know, we really can't fault it at all. It's, it looks good, which is always a, a plus, but we know that it's going to function as it also should. The success of the project came about through positive partnerships that SoilCon developed with the client and with our dedicated team of subcontractors who are experts in their respective fields. 